This 10 year old has plenty of confidence today. I know I'm pretty. I'm not going to let anyone tell me different. But that wasn't the case a few months ago. I just didn't feel like I was that pretty. And I thought it was really ugly after people were telling me that I was ugly. Karis Rogers is talking about her skin tone. I felt like they were bullying me because of my skin color, because I was darker. She remembers a moment in first grade that still hurts. My teacher we was supposed to draw ourselves, and she gave me a black crayon instead of a brown crayon. And I came home crying. I didn't know what to do. Her mom did and switched her to a more diverse school, but still the comments continued. A couple girls that were bullying me because I was too dark, but they were coming from black girls too. So I was really confused. Her big sister was not. There is an issue of colorism, I think, in every race. So their mom enrolled Karis in a Saturday program at Amazing Grace Conservatory, where they held this fashion show a few weeks ago. Big sis Taylor Pollard couldn't help but post a couple photos on Twitter, writing, My sister is only 10, but already royalty, adding the hashtag flexin in her complexion. She's a chocolate girl, and she was dressed nice and cute, had her hair, her natural hair showing. And, you know, I just want to put out there that she's flexing in her complexion. It resonated with thousands of people on social media, liked 80,000 times. The compliments poured in. In social media, it seems like people are more willing to give her compliments. Reaching an audience she wouldn't ordinarily meet. And, like, after I read all those comments, I was like, wow. Am I really that pretty? Yes, Karis, you are. On the outside and in. And as for those bullies, she now knows what to say. Everybody is pretty in their own way. A lesson for other girls, young and old, regardless of their complexion. Always believe in yourself. Don't let nobody tell you different. Joy Benedict, CBS 2 News.